Good morning. This is my kitty sitting in the sunshine, staring at me because I have no treats. Yep. Hello. Good morning. I have the washed, not washed, I've done my hair. I guess like co wash. Not really. Um, co wash just means like washing with conditioner only or whatever. I didn't do that. It's just wet and I put product in it. I combed it through really, really well. I'm getting dressed. My good bra, the black one that I had just purchased, is dirty because I wore it. It's so comfortable. I've actually worn it like a lot of times. So I will put on this bra. It's more like a bralette. It, since I sit most of the day, I don't really need to be like super lift, supported. That's the word I was looking for. You know, I'll just put this on. Okay, so I'm um, trying to think of what shirt to wear. I've got my leggings on today. I really want to wear a shirt that's like long going past my butt. Um, let me think. I will think about it, and I'll be right back. I'm choosing this one because it's comfortable. It will keep me warm at when at the office when it's super cold, and it's quite long. Why is it so long? I don't know, but it's it's very long. I like it. Because um, I can kind of wear it if I wanted to, like around the house, I would just wear it with no pants, you know, just the shirt. Or wear it with shorts and you wouldn't be able to see my shorts. It's long. That's how long it is. Right? It goes way, it goes past my butt. You know what? Let me just show you. See? See how long it is? My butt ends here. It goes way down like it's a dress, practically. And it's, this is so, why is it so long? I don't know anyone's torso that is this long. Anyways, I am dressed. I'm going to get going because I want to buy those cookies at Quick Trip. Yeah. So anyways, uh, yeah, I guess I'll just talk to you later, and, um, goodbye. Check this out, there's a little duck, not a little duck, there's a duck over in the corner. You can see it, and it came out. Quack, quack, quack. I don't want to scare it, so I'm going to go over this way. I've gave it, I fed it some cookie crumbs. It's so nice out today. It's a little duck over here. Oh, see? Hey, don't run away, duck. I don't want to hurt you. See, little duck. It's a mallard. Or is this female? I think she's got eggs. I want to look, but you know, I don't want to scare her. Don't worry, duck. I'm on my lunch break. Come eat the crumbs I left. The little cookie crumbs. Maybe someone will come feed you bread. Right? I'm saying that. It'd be nice. You got a little fuzz on you. A little, little uh, fur on your or fur feather on your beak a little feather on your beak here you go sit on your nest again go back there anyway I don't want to scare her away because if she's got eggies she got little ducklings we don't want to scare little duckies anyway look at my view you see that back there I can't see what I'm looking at the lake Ugh. 
there. See the lake? There's a little boat out, not little, there's a boat out there. A boat. Boat, boat, boatily boat. Boat, boat, boating around. Woo! He's coming in for a landing. I don't know what happens with boats. I drove a boat once. I did not like it. I will not drive a boat again. But it's so nice out. I gotta be out here just in the sun. The shade is okay. I prefer to be out here. So hopefully the duck will come and eat the little cookie pieces. Little cookie crumbs flying around. And that'll be great. And I'll come and check on the duck every time I'm here. Bring bread next time. Maybe I got some bread at home. I can bring that. Yeah. And they'll be like, don't feed the ducks. And I'll be like, screw you, I'm feeding the duck. Let's name her. We're gonna name her. I feel like she's a Penelope. I just feel like that's that's correct. We'll call her Penelope. Maybe. We'll see. Anyway, I'm gonna enjoy my lunch now. Okay, hello. Good evening. I have arrived home. And Russ is not home yet. And I don't know if it's just because the about the uh, rush hour or what. I don't know. But it's really nice outside. And I really wish I knew the weather was accurate. Because when I check it yesterday, it's not. Yesterday says rain today. No rain. Sunny warm whatever but had i checked earlier oh i should probably close the front door um or uh had it been accurate i would have got steaks out and some grill and we could grill out you know tomorrow's thursday um and tomorrow says rain but in the afternoon if it's rain in the afternoon but a high of 70 may or may not be nice i don't know so we go down here to the basement we check in the freezer we've got all those steaks right there and some up here too what's this Look at this. This is probably freezer burnt. Reduce. What is this? It's ground turkey. Oh. I didn't know we had this down here. Well, son of a bitch. Well, that's good. Hello. Anyways. Got all these steaks down here. Uh, I'm gonna go upstairs. All right, good evening, hello. It's 8.05. No supper. I want a bowl of cereal. This is fruity rice. It's not fruity pebbles. Okay, don't close on me now. So, I, one moment. I have not had a bowl of cereal for supper in a very, very, very long time. Like more than a year at least. Um, if you are the type of person, if you pour your milk before your cereal, I believe you are a sociopath. Sociopaths do that. Don't be a sociopath. Anyway, I have my cereal now in my bowl, and now I just need a spoon. Okay, so um, I just wanted to say hello, good evening. I've been home for quite some time. I'm going to be watching TV next. Very exciting. All right, I had my bowl of cereal 
I am watching based on a true story, which I forgot about. On Peacock? I think, yes. Anyway, watching it. Uh, yeah, I got I got nothing to add. So, Russ's stuff continues to accumulate as he gets ready for his weekend. Um, right. Uh, just a lot. A lot of thing. I don't know. A lot of nothing. Uh. Uh. I got nothing. Have a good night. Toodles.